Minus 90, still go. Our status board here in firing room two indicates all is still low with the countdown. Third stage tanks now pressurized as the automatic sequence continues. One minute, 15 seconds and counting. Astronaut Alan Bean has just brought the entry batteries on the main power source in the spacecraft. We've conserved those batteries up to this time. We're coming up on 60 seconds. Mark, T minus 60 seconds and counting, T minus 60. Alan Bean running up the volume on his VHF. 50 seconds and counting, 50. We've now gone internal power with the launch vehicle. We're on the internal batteries in the three stages of the Saturn V. T minus 40 seconds and counting. The spacecraft commander now performing his final function, pressing a button to align the guidance and control system of the spacecraft. Coming up on 30. Mark, T minus 30 seconds and counting, T minus 30. 25 seconds and counting, we're still proceeding. T minus 20. 17 seconds, swing arm back. We have guidance internal. 10, 9, 8, ignition sequence start. 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Zero. All engines running. Commit. Liftoff. We have liftoff. 11.22 a.m. Eastern Standard Time. Chief Conrad reports that your program is in. Tower clear. We have a program and this baby is really gone. Pete. Pete Conrad reporting the rolling ditch program to put Apollo 12 on the proper course. Houston, try SCE to auxiliary, over. NCE to auxiliary. SCE, SCE to auxiliary. Ecom reports the readings back. Mark, one Charlie. One Charlie. Flight director. Jerry Griffin taking a staging status now. Apollo 12 down ran range 17 miles. Altitude 20 miles. Apollo 12 Houston, try to reset your fuel cells now. Inboard engine out on schedule. They are having some problem aboard the spacecraft. You heard uh, Conrad report. He said, I don't know what happened, gang, but a lot of things dropped out here. They were having some trouble with their platform and also with their fuel cells. And the flight director and his support crews in Houston are passing up instructions for them to uh, try alternate approaches. Good staging and good thrust on the second stage. Right now, there are problems here. I don't know what happened. Uh, I'm not sure you get hit by lightning. He said he's not sure they didn't get hit by lightning. Okay, I have a good GDC, and Al has got the fuel cells back on, and we'll be working on our AC buses. Right, Pete, your uh, fuel cells look good down here. Going through those clouds was um, rain clouds. We need to do a little more all-weather testing. Amen. Uh, it seems to have given them some problem, which they're now overcoming. Good show, Pete, you're in mode two. 
Launch escape tower has been jettisoned on schedule. We're coming up to the uh, and first And we confirm the engine skirt separation also. Downrange 122 miles, altitude 61 miles, velocity 10,000 feet per second. So, uh, we've got uh, an ISS light on and we've got a cycling CO2 partial pressure high, which I don't bother me particularly, and we have reset all the fuel cells, we have all the buses back on the line, and we'll just square up the platform when we get into orbit. Roger, Pete. That sounds good. Hey, that's one of the better sims, believe me. <laughs> We've had a couple of cardiac arrests down here, too, Pete. <laughs> there wasn't any time for that up here. But we've got a good uh, clock running here, and uh, correct me, I'm going to give you a mark at 4 plus 30. I've lost my event timer, and um, mark, 4 plus 30. Looks good, Pete. He was right okay, on. Okay, we're all organized again, Jay. The only thing we've lost now is the ISS. Uh, our number one ball is just dripped all over the place, and we'll have to catch it later. Roger, Dick. Can I talk to you and see, guys, think about how we're going to get that thing, because it's just drifting, it's floating. Okay, we're thinking. The trajectory is right down the lines on the plot board. Altitude is 85 miles now. Houston, we won't be sending you an S-4B to COI call. Okay, understand, and uh, can you give us some good words like, uh, let's uh, uh, get the, the disky, I mean the IMU calm down is rolling all over the place. Okay, Pete, uh, and if you do a mode four, it'll be on the backup. Yeah, no, I got a good uh, SCS. Okay, good show. I got a little uh, vibration of some kind. Uh, she's chugging along here, minding her own business, though. Okay, Pete. Velocity is 13,500 feet per second now. Altitude 92 miles. Apollo 12 downrange 345 miles. Roger 12. Apollo 12 Houston, level sense arm, 8 plus 3, 7. Cutoff, 9 plus 1, 1. Okay, here comes the couple motor. 